Hello there and welcome to Fairyland Cottage and thanks very much for joining me here today. It's that time of year when our skin on our body can just need a little bit of extra moisturiser. So I'm going to share with you a very simple shea butter cream that I'll use all throughout the winter months to keep myself nice and moisturised. So I'm going to use things like almond oil, jojoba oil, some essential oils and the wonderful aloe vera plant. Aloe vera is wonderful. It's so gentle on our skin. It's a thing that you keep in your kitchen. If you ever get a burn, just place it on the burn and it really heals and soothes it. Now the main ingredient is shea butter. And you can just use the shea butter on its own, but we're just gonna make a nice little cream for ourselves. So pop the shea butter into a bowl over a pot of water and you're just gonna melt it. Next I'm going to add the carrier oil. I'm going to use almond oil, but you can change the oil up to your preference. And then some jojoba oil, which is highly nourishing during these winter months. And some aloe vera straight from the plant. Give it a little mix together and then it's time to add in wonderful smells. So for this it's very personal. I love smells like bergamot oil, cedarwood oil, lavender oil. So you can add just one smell if you like. Give it a little smell test and then give it a good mix and pop it into the freezer for about 15 minutes because you want it to start to harden and you'll see it has a little layer on top, that's when you know it's ready. And with a whisk, off you go and blend it up like you would some type of cream. And you keep going until it reaches this wonderful butter consistency. And all that's left to do is place it into a sterilized jar, I'll always just reuse jars. And to sterilize in just 10 minutes in boiling water should do. Make sure it's completely dry before you add it in. You don't want any water in there. And that's it, it's so simple. It's very economical. A very small amount will go a long way it's rich and it's nourishing and it's great as well at this time of year if you want to make it for some gifts for people so let me know down below if you like shea butter and I'd love to know how you get on if you make it so chat to me as always below or on Instagram have a wonderful week keep it simple and slow and I'll see you in the next video bye